I am semi back from the dead. I have had like COVID or a gnarly cold or something for like the past four days and Harlow and I slept for like four hours this morning. So she did so well with that sickness. I sat down the other day and tried to film here and like I got like a little bit of makeup on my face and I was like there is no way that I can do this. I don't know if it's been four hours but I'm taking these. I don't think I can do this. I can't do this. I can't do this right now. I'm so tired. So um, a little rough over here, a little rough, <laughs> but I've had these little piles of clothes that I ordered from Old Navy, Amazon, and Walmart that I've been wanting to do like a little clothing haul on. I am still not down to pre-baby weight, which was 142. I'm 149 right now and I am 5'9", and I'm typically like a 29 in jeans and usually a smaller, a medium, and top. Just to give you some like reference, because I'm gonna share the sizes of everything that I got today as well. Um, but yeah, excuse my voice, I just, it's not one in three years that I actually get sick. I have like an amazing immune system. Like I pretty much never get sick. And we went to Disneyland and I mean, it doesn't matter how good your immune system is. If you go to Disneyland, like you're bound to get hit with something gnarly. So let's jump right into it. This top was styled so poorly on <laughs> Walmart's website, but I could see through that. I was like, this is gonna be really cute. Um, so this, like I like how the arms are sheer. Um, they are long enough, I have pretty long arms and this was long enough for me. This was $18, I ordered this in a medium. Now, I think this is super cute. The only issue that I do have with this shirt is that these cups are just padded and there's no wire under here, so it doesn't, and it's not a super tight fitted top, it's more like stretchy. So those don't really sit right on your boobs like they should, especially if you have larger boobs like I do, it kind of like the bottom um, seam would kind of come up over one of my boobs. So you'd have to continuously um, like place this like where it needs to go. So if you're wearing this for like a short period of time or just a dinner or something, um, it could work, but it could also get kind of annoying trying to make sure that like the boob area thing stays where it's supposed to be because um, it doesn't it doesn't really like to stay put. But other than that, I thought this was really cute. I adopted one of my mom's cats and she is now behind the camera on the windowsill. Tipsy, what you doing? Her name's Tipper and I have a million nicknames for her already. So this next one is, I just love a good old um, like Canadian tuxedo. <laughs> so I saw this on Walmart and I thought it was super cute. I love the little tears in it. This was $40.99. Yeah, Everyone's just gonna love you sitting in the background stuffing your face. <laughs> Mark was um, this is almost like pretty like well fitted I would say too if you buttoned it up. There are so many different ways that you could style this. You can even put maybe some of your own pins and buttons and patches on it. I really liked it. I thought it was cute. I liked the little pocket as well. A lot of different ways you can wear this, like with leggings, with jeans, like a ton of different ways you could wear this. Um, pants, like, I don't know, the options are kind of endless. So I like a good like throw over. It's good for like living near the beach because I will inevitably put like leggings on with like a cute little top or something and then just get like cold so this is like a really easy thing to just kind of like put over um i will say one thing with ordering online with walmart i have discovered this ordering quite a few things on there i even created an account which i like pretty much never do unless i shop somewhere a lot so I was buying a lot of baby clothes on there um and then with this order i finally made an account and i had like five of my items throughout the past couple months just like canceled. Um, so I don't know if that's because the shopper couldn't find it in the store or what the deal was, but it was kind of annoying to like do all of that shopping just to have my order just fucking canceled. So I will say uh, be prepared for some cancellations if you order on walmart.com. Um, I do believe that they also have a lot of vendors that drop ship, meaning if you place an order and um, 
Susie Q is selling this in, you know, Maine from her shop, she's going to ship it to you, not Walmart necessarily. So I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. So because so many of my things on Walmart got canceled, I only have the two items from Walmart. Let's move on to Amazon. I don't think I'm actually returning anything from Amazon, so I think we did pretty good here. Um, okay, so this first item, I saw this. Um, I don't remember where I saw this, but came across it on Amazon, and it is $11.89. It is very oversized, so if you don't want it quite as oversized, don't buy as large as I did, but I bought a large, thinking, oh, it'll be like oversized, but still kind of small. No, it's actually pretty oversized. So I kind of wish I would have gotten a medium, but I also love the fact that I just swim in this and it's really comfortable. So this, when you go to this product page, this one says staying alive and I actually don't see this exact graphic on there anymore, which is kind of weird. There's like a hundred different ones to choose from. I'm pretty sure they print it when you order it. And there's some really cute ones. There's one with like the moon and a skeleton and there's just like a bunch of cute ones but then there's also some really lame ones mixed in there so go check it out but I think um, the price point is pretty incredible I don't know how this is gonna hold up but even when this starts to chip off a little bit I think I'm gonna like that I like that I think it adds like character I love buying like old t-shirts that are just like chipping off and like you know just faded and stuff so um, this is also very warm so if you get hot easily um this may not be one that you'll want to wear and incorporate into your wardrobe because it's uh it gets pretty toasty it's got to be pretty cool to wear this guy especially right now I still have like a fever putting on all these clothes today I was like sweating my tits off this I really love this this is $23.69 and I bought a medium it is a cropped sweater I really like the seams and everything, they just look very well made. It's also super soft. I love how like thick it is, but you know, it just, it like, it's gonna, it hangs really nicely. So, um, hey Pipes, what are you doing girl? You making so much noise. This is a black romper. It is, um, you know, pretty like cheap feeling. It has a little bit of like, is that called ruching or whatever in the front by the boobs? It does have pockets. It's very loose fitting. I bought a medium. I probably could have gone with a small and maybe it wouldn't look quite as pajama like, but um, it does have little pockets. I don't know if I'd wear this out of the house, but like you could, um, but it's kind of just like a basic on the cheaper end. This is $26.99 actually though. So I think I, I would have thought after touching this and feeling it and putting it on that it costs like $14.99. So I don't think I would pay $26.99 again, but it is really comfortable and it's pretty cute. Um, it's just not like the best quality, but one thing that I do like that it has is you can adjust the straps so that, you know, you can make it longer or shorter if you need to, which is like, like a lot of the cheap stuff that you buy for some reason doesn't come with that a lot of times and then I'm kind of screwed like they're always too long for me which is weird because I have a long torso and I'm pretty tall <clears throat> so I find that kind of weird but um here's what Nick had to say about it is this the kind of romper you like or is this too PJ-ish don't look at my shoes I know you hate my Birkin Prada <laughs> Do you just love that like Nick is in the background of all of my like try on videos? <laughs> this next set, it is a set. I would return this out of anything if I was going to return it and it's because of the fit and the fabric. This was $21.99. It's a two piece track suit set. Um, so this looks like cute in theory. Here's the top. Um, but your nipples show through this like pretty pretty significantly because the the um fabric's just like pretty thin and like I wouldn't say it was see-through necessarily but you could definitely see my nipples <clears throat> and um I mean you could get away with wearing like like one of these guys underneath and that would probably work but um then again with the shorts they do have pockets which is nice 
so like I said in theory like this is cute but um these were also a little too um tight for me I got a, a medium size and I feel like a large would just be like too big so these kind of pinched my skin and my fat on the side so I, that's our, honestly why I haven't worn it again but um maybe I'll try and exchange it for a size up and see how it goes because I would wear this around the house like this is would be something I would like hang out in the house and wear but because the shorts are a little too tight it's not comfortable to wear for me anyways I don't like when I can just feel my skin hanging over something or like my fat hanging over something like it's just uncomfortable and like not flattering in my opinion so maybe I'll exchange this or just return it in general um I don't know I it was only $21.99 so I guess if you're like willing to like figure out the right size for yourself and then like wear like a little bra underneath like it could work for going out in but as it is now and how it's fitting currently I wouldn't wear this again or wear it outside the house this was $39.99 and it is so soft um, I really like the white buttons on here I think it adds a nice little element this is hard to say whether this is meant to be pajamas or meant to be worn out these days like I feel like that line is so blurred that it doesn't really matter it's just like whatever you feel comfortable with so I would probably actually wear this out it does have pockets which tells me I'm meant to be worn out but um, I did need to wear a, um, a white bando underneath this because the fabric is very sheer and very thin so my nipples were out um, but uh, this is super super comfortable and I think my butt looked good in it too so I definitely like this one this dress I bought in a medium and I really think that this is super cute on I really loved how it fit it also has like a zipper in the back but it has like the perfect amount of stretch where you do have some like wiggle room for size but it's not like so stretchy that it's like an unattractive like material if that makes sense it definitely like holds itself together well um and it's hard to tell in the video but this does have like a skirt this skirt that comes over and ties here so it's a little hard to tell like on this video i think in the other video and on the product page but overall i think this like <clears throat> fit really well this was 26.99 and you can also adjust the straps too so i like this because you can wear it with like i feel like you wear this with like boots or you could wear it with sandals for the beach or you could wear it even with vans if you wanted to or high top converse so lots of different ways that you can wear this um i love this i'm glad i bought this i think it was a good price too this is like a bat it says a baggy wide leg jumpsuit so when i pulled this out i was just like dude there's no way in hell this is going to fit look how wide this is um so truth be told i could go with a smaller size let's see i did buy a medium so yeah i um was spot on thinking it was a little large when i pulled it out it's like pretty big but I also could get away with wearing this size because of the way that it fits and just the way that it hangs like it's meant to be kind of a, a baggier I own so many of these honestly you guys have probably seen me wear these all the time this is like my go-to when I'm feeling bloated I don't know what to wear I'm feeling a little bit pregnant no that's not a hint I'm not pregnant I'm literally bleeding so much right now like I'm on my period TMI but yeah it's rough um I really do like how you have multiple options so I tied this off but there are other holes here so you can really adjust like the strap length um, which is super useful if you have large boobs or small boobs like sometimes you just need some more space and some more options there so they definitely give that to you there um, I also um, do really like the bottom it's hard to see here but it's kind of like I don't know what this is called but this is a cute little like closure around the ankle last item from Amazon so this dress was $36.89 um, don't try and pull this up from down below and up it's not gonna fit over your hips if you have childbearing hips like I do um, what size did I buy this in oh there's a zipper under the armpit no wonder I couldn't get it on I put it on over the top and I was like okay this is a little difficult shimmied it down but um I'm trying to figure out what size, what size did I order 
This dress I love. It's just so simple and like so lightweight. Um, I like this stretchy stuff right here. I thought the sleeves were really cute. They could be like capped or they could be like off the shoulder. I also put this on um, with a couple different shoe options for you. I liked it with like the high boots and then I also really liked it with high top converse. Um, high top red converse would be really cute with this as well. So um, I really like this one. I think this was a good pick and um, this one also has a bunch of different like colors. So if you like if you just look at the product page you can see like all the different colors. It's got like any color you could want, this dress comes in. Last but not least, Old Navy. I've definitely been sleeping on Old Navy. When I was pregnant, you guys were like, you need to check out Old Navy, it's awesome. Hang on, the TV's on, I gotta shut the door. You guys told me to check out Old Navy when I was pregnant and I was like, looked through some of the stuff, didn't really see anything eye-catching, but with Old Navy, I've realized you need to um, have an imagination, kind of like I did with some of the Walmart items. Like you need to re-envision it on you and style differently because I don't think that they always do a great job at that. So if you can do that and you have like some, you know, imagination, I think that you can make some of these pieces look really, really good together. So um, first I got this, one of my um, items got canceled on here too, which I was bummed about, but um, uh, I got this little flannel shirt. This one is medium and it was $39.99 and this matches my background right now so well. Um, the sleeves were actually a little too short for me so I do have to roll them up when I wear it. But again, I just love a good old flannel. You can wear it so many different ways. Pants, shorts, leggings. Um, I might even wear this to um, the airport tomorrow or tomorrow, the next day. Um, we're flying to Nashville for the month of November. So by the time you see this video, I'll probably already be in Nashville. Um, but yeah, this is like super cozy. It's not too thick, but it's like, it's pretty, it's like pretty lightweight. So I feel like you can kind of get away with this like all year round. But, um, yeah, again, my tall girls, if you got long arms, you're probably going to have to roll up the sleeves. Just a little FYI. I love the color of this dress. When I first put this on, I was thinking to myself, wow, this is a little matronly, but then I kind of just like leaned into the like My Little House on the Prairie aspect of this dress, put a hat on, and I think it turned out really cute. I love that it has this stretchy part in the back, so it made it really easy to get on and off. And at first, I thought that these um, I thought that the bows on the shoulders were kind of set and they were like sewn, which I kind of always love in a way because they always, these are so hard for me to do on my right side. I cannot do a bow to save my life. I always have to have Nick do it, but they weren't, which was ended up being a better thing for me in this situation because I have large boobs and I needed to have some more space for this to come down a little bit because this seam was like up really high. So um, I like that it has two little slits as well. It does have pockets. I swear everything has pockets these days, which I'm so in love with. It didn't used to be like that. And I just love that there's pockets in everything. I got a medium and I would say that it fits really well. Um, if anything, it could be like a tiny bit smaller, but definitely not any bigger. But I love the color of this. I think, um, I think I'll be wearing this a lot, especially next time I'm pregnant. I think this will be a really good dress to kind of pull out and have in the wardrobe with a growing belly. Lastly, I have discovered how amazing Old Navy leggings are. So my favorite new leggings are Aries leggings that have like a little bit of the ruching at the top. They're so comfortable. They're so affordable. Um, I will link them for you below and then I, ha I have them in like every color. And then also the Old Navy Leggings, these are so comfortable. I wanna say that these are 100% polyester, but they're called Power Soft, and these are in a medium, and um, it's got like some little storage for like your keys or whatever if you're gonna wear these at the gym. I haven't worn these at the gym yet, just kind of out and about. I don't even go to the gym anymore, what am I talking about? I didn't haven't worn them working out yet at my house. Um, I like that it has this big uh, band I don't like leggings that have small bands. They just roll down and they're extremely annoying. 
So these leggings are like so soft. They're so comfortable. These were literally $9 when I bought them. I think that they're currently out of stock, but check it out, buy a different color maybe. I love the camo. I think these are super, super cute, especially um, paired with this sweater. But the leggings, like don't sleep on Old Navy leggings. These are so comfortable, so comfortable, so comfortable, so comfortable, so cheap. How are they? They're like $9. Um, also love this sweater. This is size uh, small and this is $39.99. Um, this is a small, so it's definitely like oversized. I also really like this side here. I think that opening is really cute. So this with the leggings is just like super comfortable, super cute. Um, you can wear tennis shoes with it. You can wear sandals with it. You can wear little slides or little mules, like whatever you're feeling, however you want to wear it. But um, yeah, love these leggings. Like I've been wearing this little outfit like nonstop since I bought it. So yeah, don't sleep on Old Navy. I definitely won't be anymore. You just have to have a little bit of creativity when you're looking at some of their default or their profile, profile pictures, default pictures, product pictures, because sometimes they just don't like have the best eye when they're styling their items. So just keep that in mind. That's everything that I purchased at Amazon, Old Navy and Walmart. Let me know some of your favorites and what other online brands am I like, should we not be sleeping on? Because Old Navy was definitely one of those for me. I didn't realize how much cute stuff Old Navy had. Sorry I didn't listen to you guys sooner, but thanks for watching guys. We will see you in the next video. Bye.